Hi, we are going to go over some breakfast systems. And one idea that may fit into your nutrition practice is utilizing a jar and doing some type of overnight oats, or you can do overnight chia pudding. There's many different options here available to you. Um, but we are going to use an example of things that we have on hand. So we're going to use some rolled oats and start with that um, in our jar. Then we're going to add some sunflower seeds. So that's adding a little bit of protein. So you always want in your jar there to be some type of a protein source, some type of a grain and fruit. So we chose the rolled oats for our our grain, then we're going to add some sunflower seeds for some protein. Our fruit is going to be frozen dark cherries. So we'll add those to the mix. And then if you'd like, you can add um, a, a couple different things. You could add uh, milk to it. So whether it's cow's milk or this is a hemp milk, rice milk, coconut milk, almond milk, and you can choose to add a yogurt. So this is an almond milk yogurt, but you can also um, add any yogurt that you'd like. You do not have to add yogurt to it, but it does add a nice creamy texture. Um, so we're going to pour, to make sure there's enough liquid. Typically, you want it to be a 50-50 ratio, but depending on what you put in, you may have to stir it up and make sure that there's enough liquid still in the jar so that when the oats expand, um, they will have you know some type of a liquid to absorb so it doesn't get too thick. And if it does get too thick, it's okay. You can just add more um, liquid to it and it will be just fine. So you can add, we're gonna add a little bit of almond milk yogurt to our jar. And then if you'd like, and I usually add this towards the end, but an almond butter or peanut butter, you can do a drizzle on top, or when you open the refrigerator and your breakfast is going to be all ready for you with a protein, a grain, and fruit, then you could add a drizzle um, for fun, for flavor, you're going to add a little bit more protein and some fiber um, from the almond butter or peanut butter um, or any nut butter that you choose. So it can be just a fun um, nutrient dense addition to your breakfast. Um, so after we're all set, again, adding, just making sure that there's enough liquid covering all of the in ingredients and you can take a spoon to stir it all up or you could easily just put the cap on and shake it up this way. Um, if you would like to add a sweetener to it, you could add some honey or maple syrup. Um, you could also add cinnamon. So there is plenty of room for intuitive um, cooking or intuitive preparing your overnight oats or overnight chia. If you were going to use chia, it's almost the same ratio. You want it to be a 50-50. I hope everyone enjoys their breakfast this week and has a lot of fun.